Welcome to Digital Impact Square, a social incubation center with a vision to lead change by creating change makers. Digital Impact Square, a Tata Consultancy Services Foundation initiative, was established in the city of Nashik, Maharashtra in 2016 with a mission to create societal impact through empowering young change makers. Nurture social entrepreneurship for sustainable and scalable impact using digital technologies and build a culture of innovation in the social sector. In the last four years, more than 350 change makers have participated in this journey and more than 12 successful startups have been incubated, collectively impacting more than a million lives in India and counting. Over the last four years, Digital Impact Square has created a highly successful innovation process that maximizes the chances of success for any aspiring individual or social startup. This process, called the Spot, Probe, Grow, Scale, helps teams to start their journey as ideators, to moving on then to becoming innovators, and ultimately entrepreneurs, creating their own successful social startups. In this journey, spanning 12 to 18 months, Teams get access to personal mentoring by experienced coaches, deep access to the ecosystem through various partners, and funding to help them sustain and grow. The spot phase. This phase is aimed at identifying problems worth solving, along with building relevant partnerships and the right teams with the passion and commitment to create impact in those challenge areas. This year, Digital Impact Square has identified the thematic areas of assistive technology, Agri-tech and agricultural skill development, rural entrepreneurship, and telemedicine as its core focus areas. It is very important that teams working in the social space get access to domain expertise and mentorship. The spot phase also focuses on building ecosystem partnerships to facilitate and enable this access. Finally, no aspiring startup can succeed without a strong team of passionate and committed individuals with a deep desire to make an impact and enhance lives. The spot phase seeks to identify and support such teams to succeed. The probe phase. The probe phase is where teams spend time to first deeply understand the community and its needs and aspirations, and then co-create solutions for the challenges faced by the community. This phase is divided into two sub-phases. Phase one, which is known as the pre-incubation phase, and phase two, which is known as the virtual incubation phase. Now let us see what happens in phase one. This is a 10 week program where the focus is predominantly to help teams understand the problem fit. The teams are expected to understand the community and develop deep empathy for the user community for which they're trying to solve this problem. The focus here is to refine and demonstrate problem fit, ideate, co-create, and define minimum viable prototypes and onboard pilot users for the same. This 10 week virtual bootcamp is designed to help teams get ready for incubation. Use design thinking principles to build a deeper understanding of the problem that they're trying to solve. Be mentored by some of the most experienced mentors in the domain space. Participate in masterclasses conducted by the best in the industry in areas such as entrepreneurship, creativity and innovation, cutting edge technology, and human-centric design. Get a one-on-one -on -one coaching by Disk Innovation and Design Coaches to significantly enhance the MVP access, technology experts from TCS to assess and identify the best technology that can make the MVP scalable. And finally, engage with Disk Alumni who have created successful social startups to understand their journey and understand the best practices. At the end of this phase, each team will be required to pitch the refined problem statement and MVP concept with jury comprising of disk management and domain experts. Successful teams will be shortlisted to move to the next phase. The next phase is the virtual incubation phase. The focus here is solution fit and the phase will last for about three months. The focus would be to refine and demonstrate solution fit, iterate the MVP with pilot users and build business model for viability. Post the incubation pitch, shortlisted teams will be formally inducted into the DISC incubation process. This phase will allow the selected teams to get DISC funding in the form of stipend to core team members, build the MVP into scalable products, validate the MVP on field with real users, 
onboard MBA and technical interns from reputed institutes to further announce the MVP. Work with DISC coaches and mentors in building the business model. And finally, get access to communities and ecosystems to relevant partnerships. This phase two will end with a pitch session for evaluation and promotion of teams to the next phase, where they will get additional funding and accelerate their journey towards building sustainable social enterprise. Teams that move into the grow phase will get an additional funding for up to 12 months to help them convert their prototype to a product. Digital Impact Square will provide additional resources and focus mentorship along with its partners to help its team build robust and scalable products and services. The team will get an opportunity to interact with and get mentorship from successful social entrepreneurs as well as DISC alumni. This phase transforms the team into social entrepreneurs and execute their business model to build a sustainable and viable enterprise through onboarding their first paying customers. At the end of the growth phase, teams are expected to come up with a minimum viable product or service. Finally, we reach the last phase, which is known as the scale phase. At the end of growth phase, innovators are transformed into powerful change makers. This is where their successful journey at DISC ends. They can now exit by retaining their own IP and form their own for-profit or not-for-profit social enterprise and start a brand new chapter of their own. They get access to the TCS's global co-innovation network to showcase their products beyond India. By this stage, teams are self-sufficient to generate their own leads and are able to organically create a pipeline of prospective customers. At the end of this journey, the aspiration is to create value and impact at a scale where millions of lives are impacted. Now let's see what is the eligibility criteria. In case you are wondering if you're eligible to apply for this cohort, you should apply for this virtual incubation if you are an individual or a team of committed and passionate individuals wanting to create social impact. Or an Indian citizen below the age of 27 years. You have a prototype or detailed solution addressing challenges of one of the four thematic areas that we mentioned earlier, namely assistive technology, agri-tech and agriculture skill development, rural entrepreneurship, and telemedicine. You are an early stage startup with no equity or seed funding from any other sources. If you're wondering where to apply, the process is fairly straightforward. Visit the Startup India website at startupindia.gov.in. Look for the programs option. Click on the programs option and you will be taken to active programs. On clicking active programs, you'll be shown all the challenges that are currently open, including the ones from Digital Impact Square. Click on, on any one of these challenges will take you to the detailed challenge page where you will have an option to apply now and a detailed form will be made available to you, which you can then fill and provide as many details as possible to maximize your chance of getting selected. If you have any more questions or any doubts or any queries, please feel free to reach out to us. You can visit our website, digitalimpactsquare.com or follow us on any of our social media sites on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, or Instagram. We look forward to hearing back from you soon. Thank you.